Also breaking tonight, flames reignite in a home that was purposely set on fire. Right now, the search is on for an arsonist before he strikes again. Five fires in two days, all of them set on purpose in Lake County. Tonight, a family came home from vacation to find their home gutted by fire. News 6's Eric Sandoval was at that home in Umatilla when the flames reignited. And first, Eric, was anyone hurt in this? Uh, nobody was hurt, but, you know, it did raise tensions here a little bit tonight, more than they already were, Lisa. We were actually the ones who called 911 to get fire crews back out here. This is the home that they arrived to today. You can see it was uh, gutted by fire, set on fire early this morning. Tonight, we are looking for an arsonist here in Lake County. News 6 was there tonight as Umatilla fire crews arrived to this home hit by a suspected arsonist on Wilson Parish Road. Winds had fanned a hot spot in a tree, sending sparks into the night sky. Inside, the homeowners who drove all day to make it back from South Carolina moved room to room trying to gather whatever valuables they could find. Meantime, four miles away. I get up in my vehicles burning to the ground. Alfred Simmons car was torched early Sunday morning. Two of five suspected arson fires now being investigated by the state fire marshal's office. They just said they, they don't know, asked me if I had any enemies and I said no man, I fart not to do that. Take a look at this surveillance video given to News 6 by another place hit by fire, the Old Crow Barbecue. It shows a man enter the back of the restaurant where he wraps something in a rag and walks out. Less than a minute later, you could see the darkness light up with fire. The owner says thankfully this fire fizzled out. And tonight, the family who lives in this house tells us they hope whoever set this fire is caught soon before they strike again. And back out here live, that family actually just left here just a short time ago. They came back to salvage what they could. Umatilla Fire and the State Fire Marshal's Office are looking for whatever information they can get to uh, find out who did this. According to this sign right here, the number to call is one eight seven seven no arson We're live in Umatilla tonight. Eric Sandoval getting results. New 6.